My name is Michelle Long and I'm the project manager for the Outdoor Classroom at Terrace Community Middle School. We are really proud that we could work with community organizations and make local partnerships that are committed to the project, not only to focus the students in their area of expertise, but be able to be role models for responsibilities of citizenship and to help them become lifelong stewards in their environment and in their local communities. This Tampa Bay Estuary Program grant provided plants, tools, seeding areas, not only to restore the habitat and be able to observe, but also to make trails in order to discover transitional habitats as well. There's a modified wetland, an oak hammock, and a pine upland. This is very exciting for students to be able to plan their way to get from one environment to the other. These students are able to now identify, observe, record, report what they see, everything they see in the outdoor classroom. They understand growth rate of the plants over time, frequency and types of birds that visit their outdoor classroom, and the quality of water that's available in this modified wetland. This all ties in very nicely to their seventh grade life science curriculum. On the day the students planted the bald cypress in the modified wetland, News Channel 8 paid us a visit. This morning with a look at a unique program helping middle school students learn more about the great outdoors. Yeah, this is pretty neat. Terrace Community Middle School sits on the banks of the Hillsborough River Bypass Canal. Well, the students typically walk into the classroom right through that front door, and they rarely see the water and natural woodland right behind the school. Well, Lee did some digging, and she found out that that's all changing, isn't it? That's right. The seventh graders right now are working to create an outdoor classroom to bring learning off the pages and right into their hands. We're making trails, and, make, and we made one trail here and another trail there, and we're going to connect them. The area behind Terrace Community Middle School is becoming a learning environment to take the knowledge learned in a desk and apply it. These seventh graders are even learning while they're planting the outdoor classroom. Hey, what would be a, a good environment for this particular cypress? Because it needs a lot of water. They're going to have science stations, collect data, do measurement on their trees. An outdoor classroom provides hands-on understanding of concepts, but also promotes team building and better communication skills. And then we got the science teachers involved, and they were super excited because it's right in with their biology and the ecology. And the different species of plants, like some, like which plants are invasive, which plants are actually native. How we had bird watching, sun, a lot of new animals, and like what goes on while we're in the classroom. A living legacy of learning, literally, in their backyard. They've already said today, when we come back in 10 years, will we see our tree? So absolutely. Absolutely. The outdoor classroom at Terrace Community Middle School is, in fact, a community effort. They receive grants and get volunteer support from the Tampa Bay Estuary Program, the Suncoast Native Plant Society, Temple Terrace Garden Club, and the, and the Audubon Societies of Tampa and Clearwater because it's so... When students begin to take responsibility for their own role and how the environment responds, it makes a lasting impact, not only to the student, but also our world. Thank you very much for funding our outdoor classroom project.